Hey little readers, parents, and caregivers. Welcome to Ruthie's Reviews and Recs. I'm Ruthie, and I'm here to break down all the best black and diverse authored children's books from the LNA Libraries catalog. And you're in for a treat. This is a special for Emancipation Day in Canada. Do you know what that is, little readers? Well, it just became a holiday, and it's celebrated on August 1st. The holiday commemorates the date in 1834 when the British Empire abolished slavery. That means the British Empire said no more slavery for all of its colonies. Enslaved people in Canada were freed. Isn't that awesome? Today's pick for this upcoming celebration is Africville, written by Shante Grant and illustrated by Eva Campbell. This book was published by Groundwood Books. Parents and caregivers, take the time to borrow this book and read it through with your little readers. Tell them about Nova Scotia and the vibrant black community that once thrived there. Encourage them to ask questions about what happened there and why it no longer exists, despite so many still having their roots there. Talk about black history, black present, and the future that is possible for black people as opportunities are made and trails continue to be blazed. Thank you to Shante and Eva for this gift. Happy Emancipation Day. Please celebrate it by supporting black owned business. Borrow this title and others like it. Just a hint, there's a whole list in Ruthie's Reviews and Recs. <laughs> and keep the learning going. I give Africville six jaw paws out of seven. And I want to hear from you, little readers and caregivers. Get together and write a list of your favorite black authored and diverse children's books from the LNA libraries. I may just review your pick on a future episode, so stay tuned every single time. And how do you get in touch? Check for me on Facebook and Instagram at Ruthie's Reading Room. Get your adult to help you or send me a quick email, Ruthie's Reading Room at gmail.com. I can't wait to hear from you and I'll see you next time. And maybe I'll bump into you at a library. See you then.